Hi, I'm Chase Hartman from Tampa, Florida, and I want to talk to you about music. Music has always been a massive part of my life. I probably have a Spotify playlist for every mood or occasion, but honestly, music was one of the ways my shy self found a voice. It gave me the confidence to connect with others and share my opinions. My love for music first emerged when I joined my school's chorus in the fourth grade and continued when I spent three years learning the clarinet, guitar, and the piano in the band during middle school. Now, I usually listen to music no matter what I'm doing. Let's take a look at some of my favorite hobbies while showcasing some of my favorite songs. Living in Florida, spending time outside and enjoying the warm atmosphere is definitely encouraged, as long as you're not scared of gators. I love going on bike rides, taking hikes with my friends at local parks, and spending time at the beach. I even have a Tampa's Got Talent playlist that I made with my friends with the best Bruno Mars songs to scream in the car. I also listen to music while I'm working out. Yes, even at swim practice. Hip hop and pop music are the best in helping me channel my Caleb Dressel energy during a swim meet. Music also helps me when I'm studying or trying to learn new things. Whenever I get frustrated with my homework, especially physics, I turn on some house music to calm me down and keep me focused. And thanks to Latin artists like Kali Uchis, Bad Bunny, and Teo, Puedo Aprender Español Leando Sus Letras. Sorting books in my hot Florida garage for my nonprofit Eco Brothers is sometimes a little dreadful. With humidity levels skyrocketing during the summer months, it's hard to get anything done. Turning on music definitely helps me get all the sorting done faster. Whether I'm doing a simple task like studying or getting ready to crush my time at a swim meet, music gives me the confidence to complete any challenge. It has ultimately brought me out of my shell and encouraged me to connect to people from all different backgrounds. I now have the confidence to stand in front of thousands of people on a stage and inspire them to get out in their community and make an impact by solving social issues. Who would have thought one of the shyest kids who used to play Roblox by himself and read Harry Potter in his room during the weekends would develop into a leader inspired to make a difference in his community. I hope to bring my determined attitude and immaculate music taste into the Brown class of 2028. We don't have a